welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, welcome. I am doing a stitch fix video. So a little secret is that I did get a stitch fix box about two weeks ago and I kept a pair of jeans, but I sent everything else back. So they sent me another box and it was huge and it was outside and so I didn't want to bring the box in here because it got wet um, anyway so I took all the items out and I'm going to show them now and now I also realize why the box was so big because item number one hold on is this really big coat it is BCBG generation um, size small and it's a puffer coat so let's see the thing is that I'm short which I say in every stitch fix video but that's a good plug for if you want to check out my other stitch fix videos but this might be too long okay so here it is <laughs> I mean it's nice Okay, basically it goes to like almost my ankle. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm dying. It's definitely warm, so that's a plus. Now I'm sweating. Okay, let's just get into the other one. So clearly that's item number one. This is item number two. Um, let's see, it's a sweater. It's Vigos, the brand V-I-G-O-S-S, -S, the Charlie Cable Knit Sleeve Pullover. It says it's beige, but I don't, I mean, I guess it is. <laughs> On camera, you can't really tell, but there's like subtle colors, kind of. And then the sleeve. You know what it is though? I do like it, but it feels kind of like wool or just staticky and I, I don't like staticky sweaters. Let's see what it says. 74% acrylic, 22% polyester, 4% spandex. You know, it does say to machine wash cold, which I like, but maybe it's the acrylic. I don't know, I'm not good with materials, but I don't know why it's so staticky. And maybe if I wash it, it won't be. I don't know, I can't tell. This is it though. Like, I don't even wanna try it on because it's just gonna make my hair super staticky, you know what I mean? Dilemmas. Item number three. Item number three is a Love Ellie cardigan in dark pink. Oh, cute! Oh, this is cute. Okay. Oh, I like this. This is cute. This is it. It's nice. It's a very cozy material. It's a good length. Cute! All right, item number four. These jeans, Joe's jeans. They are an ankle cut hem, interesting. Actually, these are nice because they don't have any rips and normally all of my jeans have rips in them, <laughs> which I really like, but sometimes it's not always like appropriate for where I'm going. So it's good to have at least two pairs <laughs> of jeans that don't have rips. So, um, yeah, at the bottom though, they're like this because they're supposed to be ankle cut. They go all the way to the bottom, as in <laughs> they go to the bottom of my leg. Okay, the lighting is so bad. They're nice and as expected, they go all the way to the bottom and they even bunch up, even though this is supposed to be ankle length. So, I like them. 
They actually look good with this sweater too. I guess they go up higher than I normally have, but that's okay. The final item is in this little bag. I'm assuming they're shoes. Oh, yes. Okay, I think I liked this on the Stitch Fix app, so maybe that's why they sent them. Because if you've watched my other Stitch Fix videos, I'm always talking about how I only wear shoes that have some sort of heel or wedge or platform. Uh, because of being so short so they've sent me flat shoes before and I'm just like eh, no thank you so I like that they sent me these and they're good for the winter which let me tell you the Boston schools are closed today due to extreme cold so any oh <laughs> oh my gosh I'm a mess my apartment is a mess just so you know, I'm sorry, like in the clips, like my apartment looks wild. Today after work is my clean up the apartment day um, on Tuesdays usually. So, well, I swap between Mondays and Tuesdays. So don't worry, I am cleaning everything up after work. Okay, so these are probably a size six. Yes, they are. And yay, they're cute. I don't know how expensive they are though. Okay, let's get into prices. All right, prices. Let's start with what I'm wearing. So, the sweater that I'm wearing is $48. The jeans that I'm wearing. Oh, God. The jeans that I'm wearing are $168. Don't like them that much, I can tell you that. That's wild. And I know that jeans are often that expensive, but I've gotten really good jeans from Stitch Fix that are like $70. So, no thank you. Um, okay, the boots are $79, which isn't that bad. The big coat. The black coat that actually I realized is shedding all over my apartment, even though it's been here for one second. <laughs> so that's annoying. It's 160, that makes sense. Um, and then the staticky sweater that I really don't even want to try on is 58. Okay, so we're gonna say no to the staticky sweater. No to the coat. I don't want the coat because I honestly have like five winter coats because I live in Boston and it's always cold. So I have so many coats, I don't need another and most of my coats are black anyway. So no, um, I'm gonna say no to the jeans because I guarantee you that Stitch Fix has jeans with no holes for a better price. Um, so that leaves the boots and the sweater. Okay, the sweater I'm keeping because I clearly really like it. So that's a yes. And then the boots, oh my gosh, I don't know. Okay, let me just try them on real quick. Here they are. Well, I only have one on. Just one, but it's cute. Okay, I do like the boots. Are they worth 79? I don't know. Okay guys, comment down below what I should do. I am definitely getting this sweater from Love Ellie. It's only $48, love that. But then it's like, do I spend 79 on those boots? Do I? <laughs> Um, I'm also trying to be on a budget. Um, I say that in every video. People are probably like, yeah, right, but I really am. Um, so anyway, sorry that was a little bit of a chaotic stitch fix, but I have um, work today. So this was just like a, let's get this done before work. Um, so that's what's happening. I'm now gonna start my work day. I have a lot of cleaning up to do now. I like threw everything everywhere, but comment down below if I should 
keep the boots and also just your opinions on anything because I don't have to send this back for another week and a half so I have time to decide. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're all having a beautiful new year. I hope that 2022 brings nothing but good things your way. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm coming up on my two year mark of my channel and I would love to have you all be a part of it. Okay, so long. Bye everyone.